Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I would vlog, um, so today is November 6th and I'm not really doing much today, I just thought I would vlog a little bit uh, because I wanted to. Um, sorry I look a mess right now, I haven't long ago woke up, it is currently 8.02 in the morning, I've been up since 7, uh, Drew's just gone to work now, he starts at 10 till 7 which is a long long shift and as you guys know I don't work currently the only work that I get at the moment is by teaching pinup um, with jukebox beauties and my t-shirts uh, today I have a therapy session I'm going to see my therapist today because you guys know my anxiety has not been 100% recently and I need to go and try and get my mind back to how it was because obviously adjusting to moving and so much other stuff going on in my life um, I need to kind of sort my jumbled up brain out and my therapist has been helping me a lot she's really really good it's just been crazy my brain has just been a bit like ah with everything my anxiety removing and trying to get a job is ridiculous there's no jobs going here in Northampton <clears throat> and I'm really struggling and I don't get no other help with money and income like that um I try to do it all on my own um but it's crazy there's a lot going through my mind that's that's the whole point of what I'm trying to say um <clears throat> but yeah, it is November now, which I'm so excited about because Christmas, I know, I'm sorry for mentioning Christmas so early on in November, but it is my favourite time of year, I've got Christmas bedding on, it is a Mickey and Minnie Mouse one from Primark, it says Merry and Bright, and they're kind of like ice skating and stuff, which is really, really cool, um, I think that was like £15, maybe less, I don't know, but yeah, so that's what I'm doing today, I'm going to see my therapist at 12 till 1, so I've got an hour appointment, and then I'm going to come home, tidy up, because we've got the contractor coming out tomorrow to sort out a lot of stuff in this house, as you guys know, if you saw my vlog from when we were moving in together, you can see how much stuff needed to be done, a lot of that stuff has been done, till bits and bats that need that needs sorting, so that's going to happen tomorrow. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to get ready for the day and I'll see you again in a bit. Bye! So I'm now dressed everybody and I just need to do my hair. That's the only thing I need to, to do left. And I just wanted to show you an exciting package I got yesterday that I ordered. And it is the Conspiracy Collection by Shane Dawson and... Um, Jeffree Star, which is, Jeffree Star is one of my favourite makeup brands, if not my actual favourite. Um, I absolutely love his stuff, it's actually really great quality. Um, and I'm excited to show you what I got, I did not get all of it like I wanted to, or well, not all of it, but I wanted to get a lot of the stuff, but I only managed to get four items of the whole collection, but I'll show you what I got now, because I know a lot of people have been raving about this, and I'm so excited to like, Dive, dive into it so I'm going to show you what I got now so this is what I got from the whole entire collection I know it's not a lot I really wanted to get a couple more things but I'm happy with what I did manage to get because obviously it was such a high demand and we crashed the internet literally everything was down <laughs> on the basically Beauty Bay was down Jeffree Star's website was down every website you could get the Shane Dawson collection from went so this is where i got I've got the conspiracy palette let me take it out the packaging so you guys can see so this is what it looks like it's absolutely beautiful let me see if i can take it out there we go it's so gorgeous and i love the metal bit here just all the detailing on it it's just so so stunning Ta -da! this is all the colors in it and you can see me hello look how stunning they are so i use basically all of the top row on my eyelids today, as you guys know, I'm not a beauty guru, <laughs> but I use all of the top row on my lids to create like a natural kind of makeup look today with some wing liner, and I kind of like it, it's quite cool. I'm, I'm yet to dive into all the colourful like shades, like I'm looking forward to playing with Trisha, food videos, all these like colours are just so, so stunning. I love the name of this, and it's got a little pig, <laughs> pig meant. So that was the conspiracy. Now I've got two lip shades. These are the only two lip shades I managed to get. I really wanted Are You Filming, but I sadly didn't manage to get that. So I only got these two, which I got Shane and Jeffrey What the F. Um, as you can see there. <laughs> so they're the only two shades I got. Um, th this Shane is a shade that I would probably never normally wear, but because I want to play around with makeup, I decided to buy it. So I'm going to take these out of the packaging and show you them now. So this is them out of the packaging. They are so gorgeous. Like the Shane shade is like a really gold 
gold shimmery shade which I really really like and the good thing about Jeffree Star um, liquid lips is you can actually use them on the eyes they are eye safe which is absolutely brilliant so I can do a really cool winged liner with this as well especially for around Christmas time as well as putting it on my lips I love that so that's the shade Shane and then we've got Jeffree What the F which is this pink shade I've actually got this on my lips today it's a really, really gorgeous pink, and I never really norm, well, I never wear pink or any kind of lipstick apart from red. So for me to wear pink today, I'm like, I'm kind of liking it. It's quite a nice colour, I really like it. So that was the lipsticks, and now the last thing I got from the entire collection, which is one of my favourite things ever, and I'm so glad I got one, was, is the pig mirror. Look how glorious this is, like for real. It's so gorgeous. I really, really love it so much. And it's huge. Like, it's huge. It's so big. And the quality of this is amazing as well. Like, it's like made out of this like tin material, tin and plasticky material. It's such good quality. And then flip it over. Hi, guys. I just love everything about this. Like, they do have a black one of this as well. I was going to get both, but I'm glad I got the pink one because. It's literally iconic. I love it so much. So that was all I got from the Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson collection. I love everything I got. I'm hoping to get the mini controversy uh, uh, palette uh, when that comes into restock next year. Because um, that's going to be... Well, they're, the Shane Dawson collection is going to be permanent. I think that's what they said. So when that comes back to the UK next year, I'm definitely going to get that palette because I really, really like it. Also, another exciting thing uh, that I got in the post yesterday was a magazine that I'm in. I am in the Autumn October 2019 Volume 2 issue of Rocket Magazine. It comes in like this little cellophane packaging as well to keep it safe. Uh, me and Jukebox Beauties both ordered one at the same time and we basically shared shipping and stuff like that so it just saves money doing it that way. Um, so yeah, so we both ordered a copy because we are both published in here. Obviously they are the photographers and I'm the model. So my photos are in here that they took, which is so exciting. I'll link this magazine down below, guys. I'm going to show you the pictures in a minute. I'll link it down below. Um, it's really, really great. It's Rocket Magazine. And I'll link you to this exact copy that I'm in. It's so awesome. I haven't been published since last year like cause obviously I haven't been modeling as much as I normally do and I normally get published at least a few times a year and I haven't so this year uh, this kind of makes up for it. this isn't the only magazine I am in this I am in this year I am also in another magazine called retrospective magazine it's a new magazine that is out and they are based in Cape Town South Africa which is amazing um, I know the people who run the magazine quite well online obviously I don't know them in person but um, they are from the retrospective club in store and they run parade hair stuff like that you guys know about parade hair and stuff you, I've mentioned them a lot because they are really good products um, and it's kind of the people the same people that kind of run it um which is really great and they actually was contacting me quite a lot to submit some images so I said to Jukebox right do, do you guys want to submit some images and they were like yeah and then we actually got put into the final copy which is really really great I haven't got that magazine yet I've put it on pre-order so when that magazine comes I will definitely show it to you guys but I'll link it down below where you can get that magazine from that I'm in as well right so I'm going to show you uh, my pictures and a few other ladies in Rocket magazine so I'm so extra and set up a a tripod to show you the magazine that I'm in I'm really really excited about it so this is rocket magazine you can see it says rocket very faintly up the top here and it's got a lovely model on the front there and it has so many models featured in it because it's obviously like their autumn like mag and it's so you have so many gorgeous ladies in here like so many awesome photos I love them so much there's so many good ones and I just kind of wanted to show you a little bit about the mag. It has some articles in it from other models, which is really, really great. But yeah. Oh, I found my pictures, right. Um, I'm only a few pages in, actually. I'm not too far in the book, which is really cool. These are my images. I know, my hair looks so different. And I've got, like, a little, little writing bit there. Look how cool. So basically, me and Jukebox uh, did, like, some Halloween shots. Um, obviously, way before Halloween and... We haven't been able to post these pictures because um, 
we submit them to magazines so basically when you submit images to magazines you're not meant to share them on social media because that gives you a chance of not being in the magazine because they want images that no one's seen before um and they don't want you to post any from that collection uh do not submit images that you've already posted that's what happened to a lot of people in retrospective magazine um they said they had loads more ladies uh apply and send in images um but they couldn't Put them in the magazine because they've already posted them on social media so that is a no-go in this industry if you submit images or if you know a photographer that's submitting images make sure they don't post any of those images on social media before the publication comes out because it doesn't look good at all so that is a good tip to remember yeah i'm gonna stop rambling on about magazines i'm gonna go and finish getting ready for the day and go to my therapy session but yeah anyway guys i will speak to you guys when i'm back from my therapy session and i'm gonna let you know how it all went and how i'm feeling and stuff like that so i'll speak to you guys in a bit bye Hello everybody, I am back from my therapy session now. It went really, really well. Um, I realised a lot of stuff about me and I'm just about the way my mind works in general because I'm going through quite a lot of it at the moment. And today I realised I need to focus more on positive energy rather than negative energy. And that is really, really important because, you know, the universe does amazing and wonderful things and it makes us realise sometimes that we need to focus on certain things and mine is more positivity because I'm so negative and that's got to change and I've got to change that about me um so that's what I learned about in this session today and it's really really made me realize what I need to focus on I need to focus more on myself and getting myself better and um trying to cope with what I'm dealing with rather than thinking the worst situation probably possible like i need to put more positive energy out there rather than thinking oh my god this is gonna happen like my brain goes 10 to a dozen and that's what i'm trying to work on is not jump into the worst uh <laughs> scenario straight away i need to start focusing and thinking more positive and that's what i'm gonna do from today i'm really really i'm gonna try and work on it please make sure if you are struggling talk to someone that you know please make sure you are not struggling alone that's one thing i would say please please get help um you know because we all need a bit of help here and there and you know it's always nice when we have someone to talk to so yeah so i just wanted to kind of let you guys know what happening with me today and how my uh, session went but yeah anyway guys um i'm gonna go and i wanted to update you guys on my anxiety show you some bits i've got recently with the jeffree star and shane dawson collection and the magazines i've been in stuff like that it's all good positive energy this is what i need um i need to start being more positive and you know hopefully you guys can help me do that as well so i'm really really gonna try and focus on that and I hope you guys do too. So yeah, all my social media links will be in the description bar down below. Give me a message on one of them if you want to. Um, yeah, let's have a chat about anxiety and, you know, you know, let's let's beat this together because that, that's what we're here to do. But yeah, I'm going to go now. Sorry for rambling on. But as I said, I wanted to update you guys on me and what's been going on. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. If it did, please give a big old thumbs up. And don't forget to comment in the comments. And subscribe only if you guys want to. Remember to smile, stay positive and have a very good day all night, wherever you are in the world. And I will see you all again very, very soon in my next video. So take care, guys. And soup.